Hey, hello. This is our machine right here. Uh, camera on top, basic working platform. I put a piece of uh, white paper. Let's say this is fabric. And this is a software. He is showing what the camera can see. And the software, the camera takes picture sent to here. And the software will analyze this picture to define the pattern, uh, the contour of the pattern, and then to cut. Right now, I will put this, put this thing on. Let's say this is a printed pattern, okay? Uh, my colleague, you can see, this is here. My colleague will take a picture. Take a picture of this, I will be shown here. And, uh, take them a quick. <laughs> it detected these counters, and here we can choose here. Uh, that we want only the out counter or we want the inner counter also. You can see, it's gone. Now it's back. Uh, actually, it all matters. It all matters that the uh, color, the color contrast of this uh, printed pattern and uh, the fabric. Uh, that is why we recommend all the pattern to be printed with a black line. And uh, right now, showing the function. This is another piece. I threw it on. The lab. I will take a picture again. It comes out. We move it away. You see, and uh, when this counter been uh, been detected, you can uh, you can expand it, uh, positive or negative. Okay, so. In this case, if you have black line outside, you can cut this line off. Uh, and there you can set the uh, moving, uh, the speed of movement of the laser head, the power. Generally, we set uh, 300, 400, you know, all up to uh, the design you have. Uh, more simple the design, higher speed you can, you can put it. And uh, here is another thing, it's the feeding method. Feeding method. That uh, when you uh, have this uh, fabric in roll, here you can choose this uh, customize that you can put the distance you want to feed every time. After, after the cutting of the sheet, it will automatically feed. And also you can use uh, non-feeding for this, for this condition. You know the need feeding right now, so we put a zero here. This is pretty much how the software works. It's just a basic idea. If you, your operator can understand the logic, it's not complicated at all. Thank you.